For all my life, I've lived in a small, quiet farm in the heart of New Jersey. Yes, that's right, New Jersey. The state known for the obnoxious people, the garbage pit that is the New Jersey Turnpike, and the most outspoken governor in the U.S. That is where I was born, raised, and I'm so happy to have just left. Telling stories is hard, especially when your closest neighbor is about half a mile down the road. But, somehow I still had stories to tell. Without actors, props, sets, or, in the earliest years, an internet connection, I picked up photography. To be completely honest, even for a six-year-old, my photography was pretty god-awful. I did, however, manage to learn a lot about shot composition in those years, as my work went from god-awful to just merely awful. After several years of photographing Legos and landscapes, my eyes were open to a new form of storytelling, video. I was lucky enough to witness the golden age of online video. By the time I was 10, I had access to the internet on a regular basis. I saw the rise of sites like YouTube, Dailymotion, and the explosion of content that the accessibility of distribution brought. This, for me, was revolutionary. People like me, from other armpits of America, were making amazing content that was being seen by millions of people. Still without actors, or sets, or props, or anything aside from my ideas, I found a way to tell stories with what I had. Machinima is an animation style that uses video games to animate the story. It made my life easy. It allowed me to write, act out the character's motions with an Xbox controller, and edit the video all by myself. Filming could be, and was, done entirely by me. But the videos I made sucked, but at the time I couldn't have cared less. The first video I got had over 5,000 views on YouTube in the first week. Not too shabby for my first real entrance in the realm of online media. Fast forward through a few years of bad mission of to now, and I'm still making content. Having a driver's license and access to a car has made making live action films a whole lot easier. Two summers ago, I produced a short film with a group of friends, which we submitted to a local film festival, which allowed me to get an IMDb page, so I'm not complaining. While my passion is writing comedy, recently I've been trying to write more dramatic scripts to veer away from just clever wordplay and push my limits as a writer. So that's a little about me and where I am now. Thanks for your time.